Alright, so this right here, this little sight right here, this is why when y'all ask me, yo, why don't you join like Finest KO lobbies more often, or why don't you join the Brett lobbies more often, this is why. Because this is generally what I walk into every single time. It's like I might see a two or three bar connection, but the majority of the time it's always for some reason these one bar, zero bar connections. And I know, I don't know how it's going to be, I have not seen most of these people, I've not played most of these people. However, the dude in the number four slot, Hyro Yukix or whatever, I played him before, and that connection was just atrocious. It's absolutely terrible. And like, I'm trying to kind of like tone down how much shit I talk about other players in general, just because like. I shouldn't, should I? I should not tone down the amount of shit I talk about other players. Regardless, let's just say that this dude, the amount of randomness, the amount of random shit this dude does makes my Asriel look like textbook technical, like this perfect image of technical ability. The dude just goes nuts. And like, while doing that in a terrible connection is is not fun to play against. I did, in case you're wondering, I didn't get blown up by him. I did beat him, and then I got blown up by White Boy Willie. <laughs> fucking White Boy Willie, it is fucking Hazama. Hey, another three bar connection that we're probably not gonna get to play because I'll end up losing to like a zero bar or a one bar on the way there. But yeah, I got my ass kicked by White Boy Willie right afterwards. Fucking Hazama. I have no clue how to fight that damn character. I really don't. That character mystifies me. It's like. Hey, you know how, kind of like, in general... No, don't leave, you were my only hope! Ah! Um, how in general, like, there's kind of a basic flow to the neutral game. In general, you kind of know, like, if they're doing this, this is where they're going to end up, this is their options. Hazuma shits on all of that. Hazuma's just like, you know what, I'm going to do whatever the fuck I want to do, and y'all can't do anything about it. It's kind of the same thing with Taokaka. Like, for the reason why Taokaka is so damn good is because of her movement abilities, on top of the fact that all of her pokes are just like, what, yeah, fuck you, don't press buttons, mine beat all of yours. So, don't even bother hitting buttons, because I'm just going to blow you up anyway. That's Taokaka in a nutshell, and Hazuma's kind of like a lesser version of that. Like, he doesn't have as good... His buttons aren't as good, but they're still damn good. And so, like, I have no idea how to fight that character because I just, I cannot catch him. I cannot catch him. It's impossible to do. So I need to figure that out a lot. I played, uh, I did go to a little casual session with, uh, shoutouts to Monsieur's Crow Cell, White Boy Willie, and Black Mage. I had to think for a second. Like, I was going to say his real name, but his name, is, his tag is Black Mage. Um... And then Dacid Bro showing up way the fuck late and not actually playing Blaze Blue. Dick. Yo, that reset. I don't think that's worth it. Like, that can't be worth it. That did like 500 damage, didn't it? That's not worth it. Yo, Haku Bro. Please. Haku Bro. Stop hitting buttons. Like, counter hit everything. How do you get hit by that? I don't understand how people get hit by that. I really don't. Why would you use all your meter too? Like, he's alive. He's not dying. Yo, Haku Bro is really, like, he's hitting all of the buttons. All of the buttons except the one that will actually, like, get him still. Well, I say, well, okay. Then he fucks up the combo. Like, you had it. Like, that was it, bro. You had that shit. You were in there. You could have killed him, actually. I'm pretty sure Hakumin could have killed him. He had a lot of Magatama left. If you had confirmed that properly, I'm pretty sure Tsurumi would have been dead. But yeah, so I got to play White Boy Willie a bunch. I got to play against his Hazuma. I still, I mean, like I said, I'm still mystified by it. But at least I kind of figured stuff out. But basically, all I really figured out was, like, don't even bother trying to press buttons when he's coming in. Because he has, like, 17 different trajectories he can pick from. And your buttons only account for, like, two of them. So just don't press buttons. Just let him come in for free and hope to God that you can manage to like instant block something stupid and punish. Oh, you can blow him up. Oh, you can't blow him up because he's going to be a dick about it. I wonder if he could have canceled into um, 
Yeah, this person has no idea how to fight Tarumi. That's all that was. That person doesn't have a fucking clue how to fight Tarumi. But I guess that's invincible. But I'm wondering if he could have canceled into his own super... The super counter, because I'm pretty sure if he could have. Well, if he could have, I'm damn sure that he would have blown that up. But I just don't know if he's po if it's possible to counter it. Plus, on top of that, you would have to have been charging that entire time. And that person, since he landed not prone, he obviously was not charging. And I shall be right back! Oh, this person... No! No! Why would you do that? Why are you... Why would you force me to play against two one-bars? You motherfucker. And this other three-bar person joined, and they're on... Is this shit real? Like... Oh. Well, I guess I'm not going anywhere, obviously. Apparently, I'm gonna be playing against... Nobody? Nothing? Like, nobody's... What the hell is going on? This is stupid. I'm gonna give y'all a surprise. I'm not gonna play Asriel. But that depends on where there we go. That depends on whether or not we can actually get to play in the first damn place. I'm gonna get blown up. Like, if this person's actually using Kagura, I'm probably gonna get blown up. Because I don't know how to use, I don't know how to fight against Kagura. This dumb motherfucker, why does everybody have to take like five days to pick their shit? It's not a difficult process. It took like a minute just to prepare, just to actually get to the character select screen and has to run the entire damn clock down. Ugh. Motherfucker's making me hate life. And all that, too. All of that just so I can play in a zero bar connection. You know how excited I am for this prospect? I'm not. Just in case you didn't know the answer. I'm not at all. I don't want to be here. I wanted to play against three bar Tarumi. Hey, Red Devil. Bitch, I ain't red. Look at him. This motherfucker brown, you need your eyes checked. You're the red one, I'm gonna do super jump B. And it didn't work. Okay, this person's just gonna hit buttons. Nice first. I waited for that, and this dumb bitch. Oh, that's right. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'll admit it. Okay, so this person's really just gonna mash on 5A on Wake Up? Really? I suck. But just, I'll remember that now. That was terrible, that was terrible on my part. What the hell did I get 6C? I checked that hella late. I did. Mash 5A, mash 5A, do it. Go ahead, do it. And I'll purple throw you just because you're mashing 5A. Oh, I didn't purple throw him, but he's still mashed 5A. Like, the, whole, the entire point of that was to blow up his 5A. I'm going to do it again. I didn't get it, really? Dumbass. <laughs> just sitting there mashing 5A, really? Mash 5A after Gadget Finger. Brilliance! There's nothing Tiger can do about that. God, I hate online. <laughs> like, what am I supposed to learn playing against a player like that? There's nothing. I'm not going to learn anything. I'm going to do nothing but develop bad habits. That's it. That's the entire, that's all that's going to happen. Please select your character. 
Oh, I picked the wrong one. Damn it. My bad. I saw green and I was like, yo, that's the right one. And it wasn't. My badsies. I don't know why I'm doing this. I really don't. I promise I do kind of sort of know combos. I just don't know if I'm going to be able to do them because I'm not... I'm used to doing them in just like offline single player shit. Not in terrible zero and one buck connections. Oh. Oh god, that that's stutter. This is great. Good sign. Great. We're starting out well. Really? Really? That was supposed to be a 360, obviously it wasn't. Damn, look at this player all hell scrubby and shit. Really? You're gonna mash 5A? Are you serious? That was supposed to be a 360? That was a 360. But you're like you're all just really you're all really just going to mash you're just you're gonna mash 5a you're all gonna mash 5a after a move that's like plus three when i hit with it really Fucking moron. <laughs> Why am I even doing this? I don't even have to do anything impressive. Like, there's no mind. I don't have to play any mind games. I don't have to try to do any mix up. They're mashing 5A. I don't have to do anything. They're doing the work for me. <laughs> Give me. Ugh, I'm out of here. Like, no wonder that other dude left. I'm gone. This is shit. Like, I'm not. I'm not sticking around so I can play that terrible ass Azrael and that terrible fucking connection. Shit, see, I, I mean, that was my only option. Because I think I looked here and there, were, there was nobody. There was literally, there were two people, I think. Oh, there's nine now. Let's go check out this nine. I mean, honestly, the population of this game has been dra- Well, I mean, now that like, I'm actually thinking about it, the population of this game has been drastically reduced in comparison to how it was, like, even a week ago. But now that I'm, like, actually sitting here and... Ooh, let's go. Now that I'm sitting here and actually thinking about it, it is either, like, finals week or almost finals week for a lot of people, including me. Like, I'm playing at a time that's really not optimal because, um, what am I trying to say? I'm playing at a time that's not optimal because I just, I don't really have time anymore. I'm playing while I can to give you guys videos while I can. And so, because of that, I'm sure it's the same for a lot of people. Like, they're just staying off of Blaze Blue slash other games while they're in, like, you know, finishing up school. So, hopefully, it'll get a boost in, you know, the next week or two. And it'll go back up to the original numbers. But, yeah, I mean, you used to be able to find around 50, maybe even a full room if you went to these before. Whereas now, like, I have not seen them break 40 in about a week. Actually, two weeks. What? That's a terrible line. That's a terrible line, bang. Terrible line. Calling me, I'm busy! I tried to instant block it, obviously it didn't work. Oh, that's too high! Yay, overheads. 
Who's calling me? I'm busy. It's gonna stop ringing right there anyway. Yo, my phone's almost out of battery anyway. Shout out to that anti air being hella late. Oh, I tried to throw it. That's a terrible combo. Damn it! Apparently, that's a terrible combo, too. Damn. I'm fucking up all my combos. I'm not used to doing them online. I'm not used to the timing for them. So I tried to do like that one time I almost got a corner combo. And I did the five, I did the six B too early because I was scared I was gonna do it too late. And it ended up not coming out at all, damn it. Need to learn how to do combos, yo. I can't do combos. I need to learn a proper throw combo, Jesus. Let's do 5B, 5C, and Atomic Collider. That's a good combo. Dumbass. <laughs> oh, I'm a scrub. I mean, like, it's so weird having, you know, like, before this, Atomic Collider was, like, your go-to move. You wanted to use that to drag them in as an anti-air. That's what I need to do. I need to do damn 360 Cs in the air. That's what I need to be doing. Um, but, yeah, Atomic Collider was, like, that was your go-to move in the air. Um, Atomic Collider was, like, your go-to move in combos. And now, like, you really don't want to use it much, if at all. Wow, that has no drag to it whatsoever. That was, thanks for bursting there. Oh, damn, yeah, I, I fucked that up. I fucked that up. Oh my god, really? Really, Nate? That was bad, that was bad, that was bad. I had like five days to do Magnetech Wheel there and I still managed to fuck it up. And then I fuck up my anti-air too. Ooh, look at this dude doing co- Oh, okay, 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 we're gonna do that. Alright, alright, okay. Suck. I suck, I suck, I suck. I cannot be allowing that to happen. This person can't beat me? Hell no. Oh my god, that lag. Mash buttons. Let's go. Oh, okay, alright. That's not fast enough. Good to know. Shout out to my anti here right there. Shoutouts to my buttons coming out right there. Shoutouts to 5C's hitbox right there. Thanks for falling right into that. Appreciate it. I mean, this is just kind of like a poor showing. I'm, I'm not entirely sure if it's, um, I mean, part of it's just me. 
And I'm not sure if the part that's not me is like net code or not because some of the buttons that I am pressing don't seem to be coming out as soon as they should be. But then there's also a lot of stuff where like I'm not doing things properly. Like when he's hopping around my head like that, obviously I should be too seeing the shit out of him. And I'm for some reason I'm just not. I definitely should be. It's the obvious response, but you know, I'm just not. And I need to be. And I need better mix up too. I'm not running good enough mix up. Please select your character. I this is off, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I can't do a camera. Good news, though. I got a new computer on Cyber Monday. Well, I ordered a new computer. I don't have it yet. But once the new computer comes in, crossing my goddamn fingers that the Live Gamer Portable will work. And so then I'll be able to start recording using that. And you'll have the best quality video in the world rather than barely passable camcorder footage. Yeah! Really, oh, I missed? Surprised I missed? We're gonna do it again, because I'm terrible, I can't do combos. How did I not block that? That's confusing. How did I not block that? No, oh, that works. Good on you. How the hell did my... whatever. Oh, that was way goddamn late. Wait, what? Did he just do Atomic Collider? Like, did he really just do Atomic... I tried to do Magnetech Wheel. I didn't hit C. How did Atomic Collider come out? Yo, shout outs to this lag. Oh, I hit the wrong button! Where is this lag coming from? That sucks. Should have done anti air version. Should have known that wouldn't work. I'm actually not sure if, because I was obviously, you probably heard me mashing that. I'm not 100% sure whether or not um, his would have beaten mine. Like, if I have the 720 had actually come out when I wanted it to come out, rather than um, blocking Daisharin or Daifunka. That's Daifunka, I think. That's what it's called, right? Daifunka. I'm pretty sure if I had, that might have beaten it if it had come out when I wanted it to, rather than being able to block afterwards. So we'll do one more if he wants to play. Yeah, I wasn't sure because that connection did get pretty iffy in the second round there. Stuff started going downhill for some reason or another. Please select your character. I still haven't really done a legit combo yet with Tager though, have I? Like, I haven't landed a full combo. I've just been hitting, like, random hits and then doing 360s. That's pretty much the extent of my ability thus far. Yay me. Showing my talents and stuff. Oh my god, that fucking line. 
I got this, I got this, I got this, I got it. I had to plug my phone in to charge it. Oh, I had a better hitbox than I expected. Whoa, that was obviously not. Nope. Oops, oops, oops. Did not want that. One of these days, I'm going to manage to get a damn 360. One of these days! I'm trying to try the 360 see that. Yo, really? Really, Nate? Really? Shit. Oh, hey, call me out. Thanks, Antia, you're awesome. What? Like, what? You saw him standing there, right? Like, everybody saw that motherfucker standing there. I. Didn't want that. We're getting that perfect to make up for the purple grab that motherfucker ran on me. <laughs> Fucking purple grabs. I still didn't do a real combo, fuck! I had like my one good chance, my one good chance at it was when I was in the corner and I had that, I got, I, I don't remember what I had, I think I hit the uh, air unblockable 5B, 5C, and then for some fucking god-awful reason I missed the damn atomic collider, because I'm a fucking scrub. <laughs> Ugh! Well anyway, good games to you, we outie. We outie 5,000. Ugh! Let's see if anything else has opened up that we can do another video in, or if we're stuck with the shitty Fonz K.O. Lobby. <laughs> I mean, I just, I cannot join that anymore. It's always either, to be perfectly blunt about it, the level of competition that hangs out within that lobby is just low. It's not a high level of competition. I mean, you already saw, based on those two people we fucking played, doing Wake Up 5A match against Tager, which is like, the dumbest possible thing you can do. That doesn't even make it into, like, a guess. That just gives me a free anything. Because my pokes will beat yours. I've, Gadget Finger is plus, so any of my pokes will beat yours. We'll beat that 5A. It'll blow it up. Or I can just do simple mode and do 360A. Or I probably, I guarantee you, I could have purple throw, I could have purple thrown them with 360B whenever I wanted to. Because they were sitting there mashing 5A, I would have just gotten a throw counter. So congratulations to that shit. And that's, in general, pretty much the level of competition that has existed in that lobby for a while now. There's just very rare to find a quality player. And obviously, if I want to improve, if I want to get better in general, I need those quality players. Otherwise, the people are just combo practice. And that's boring. So anyway, video's about to shut off. Peace! Hope you enjoyed some tagger, even though I didn't do anything.